Good morning, everyone. I hope everyone is well and that the storm did not cause too much damage for you. Uh, so we're going to get into today's workout. We have 10 paired exercises working for 20 minutes. Sorry, working for 20 seconds on each exercise, going through both twice before we move on. And so we're going to get straight into our warm up. Just going to roll those shoulders. Good. Take it into arm swings. More weight. And the torso twist. Hip circles. Both directions. And then we have the leg swings. Ankle circles. In both directions. Other side. Good. All right, we're going to start our first two exercises. We are doing reverse lunges, squat combo. Okay, and then we're going to go into butt kicks. Nice and quick. So just those two exercises, twice on both, alternating. Just follow me. You'll get the hang of it. Next lunge, squat. Let's see, keep it going. Right, we've got 10 seconds, and then we transition into our back kicks. Nice and quick, light on those feet. Let's go. Going back into our first exercise, reverse lunge to squat. Second exercise, back into those back kicks, nice and quick for the last time. Nearly there. Well done, guys. All right, moving into second exercises. All right, two on the floor movements. Let's turn the angle of my camera a bit more. All right, first. 
exercise, plank hold, waist forward, and we're going forward punches. And keep those hips nice and still, drive those arms out. Then from there, we're going to go down you come up into Superman. Hold for a few seconds, back there. Okay, there are two. We're going in five, four, three, two, one. Plank punches, waist forward. Keep that core tight. Going down for those supermen. Try and get those thighs up off the mat. Really squeeze the glutes. Get that chest up too. Well done. Going back into our plank punches. Three, two, one. Let's go. All right, last one of Superman. See, keep going. Well done. Quick little rest before we transition to the next sort of exercise. All right. We are going into high knees, curtsy lunge. Okay, high knees first exercise, curtsy lunge the second one. We're starting in 15 seconds. Okay, guys. Shoulders back, twist up. Let's go. And we'll step it out. Just make sure that those knees are getting higher than your hips. Transitioning into those curtsy lunges, shoulders back, chest up tall, take it across as far as you can, drive through that front heel, drive through that heel. You should really be feeling the stretch through the glute of the working leg. Going back into those high knees. Remember, up high, higher than those hips. Let's go. Back 
Back into those curtsy lunges. Shoulders back, chest up. Top pull. Let's go. Good job. We are moving on. Okay, back down onto the mat for our next lot of exercises, core exercises. First one, legs up as straight as you can. Going into toe reaches. Okay, keep those legs straight. Really try and get those shoulder blades up off the mat. Our second exercise, reverse crunches. So keep those, keep that back, lower back nice and flat on the mat. Don't want to be able to get your hands on the knee. You're going to raise your hips and control them back there. All right, there are two. We are starting in five seconds. First one is those toe reaches. Remember, legs as straight as you can. Shoulder blades up. Best punches are next. Nice flat back. Good job off the mat. Control the back there. Well done, going back into our first exercise, that's toe reaches. Legs nice and straight. Straight as you can. Reverse crunch one more time. Ooh, well done. Take that quick rest. All right, next two. We have our inchworm. Inchworm push up. So keeping those legs nice and straight, shoulders back. I don't want to see anyone rounding. Walk those hands down. Walk them out. Take it into that push up. Walk your hands back in. Second exercise is a good morning. So our shoulders are back, chest is out, nice and neutral spine. Squeeze the butt, push the hips back. Take it back there, nice and low. Back up. All right, each legs, here we go. Nice straight legs, shoulders back. Walk those hands down, walk them out. Okay, you can drop to your knees. Go into your push up. Come back up. Well 
down. Don't get many of them. All right, now good morning. Hands on and head. Shoulders back, chest out. Push the hips back. Feel the stretch in your hammies. You should be feeling it all up there. Stand up. Push the hips back. Try and keep that core tight and squeezing your glutes through the whole movement. Good, back into that inch work. Let's see if we can get at least two inch ones in. Let's go. Good, one more. Well done. All right, back into those good mornings. Hands behind your head. Shoulders back, squeeze the glutes, hips are forward. Good, feel that stretch in those hammies. If you're not feeling it, your knees have been too much. Well done. All right, moving on. All right, next two, we're going into squat jumps. Nice and light on those feet. We roll up through our toes, we come down through our toes. And then we're going to go into lateral leg raises. So we really need to brace our core to keep our balance in this one. Slow and control. One side to the other. Okay, keeping those shoulders back as tight as you can through the core. All right, guys, so that first one is squat jumps. We're going in three, two, one. Let's go. Almost there. Okay, shoulders back, chest up, nice tight core, one side to the other, like a pendulum. Good, tight core, control the movement. Into our squat jumps. Once more, lateral leg raises, nice and controlled. Sit, guys. Next two, back down on the mat. We're going into a bear hold. So that is where your palms are under your shoulders. Your knees are under your hips. But we're actually going to lift those knees up off the ground. So it's our tippy toes that are holding us. From there, we're going to take opposite arm, opposite leg. 
All right, and then from there, the second exercise is a bird dog crunch. So nice flat back. We're going to take that arm out and leg out again. This time, we're going to meet in the middle, rounding through that back, tucking that chin and getting that crunch in the core. Take it back out, back down. Out, crunch, out. All right, so the first one is a bear hold to the up on those tippy toes. Brace that core. Opposite arm, opposite leg. Out, back in. The regression, of course, is just a work off those knees. All right, keeping that back nice and flat. We're going to go again, so same thing, except on our knees. Arms and leg out, tuck the chin, meet in the middle, take it back out and down. Opposite arm, leg out, tuck the chin, meet in the middle, arm and leg out. All right, back into that first one. Up onto those tippy toes. For that bear hold, break that core, stay tight, really control the movement. All right, down onto those knees. Keeping that back nice and flat. Tuck your tummy in. All right, opposite arm, opposite leg. Knee in the middle. Take it back out. Well done, guys. Little rest. We are flying through. All right, last two. Sorry, two more exercises to go. So we are on the floor once more. We are doing flutter kicks. So again, I want that back to be nice and flat on the mat. If you are arching, your legs are up too high. You need to think about tipping your pelvis and making sure that that back is nice and flat. You can put your hands under your bum to raise up just ever so slightly. Taking those legs down as long as you can and we're going into flutter kicks. Okay, really squeezing the glute and really bracing the core. Then from flutter kicks, we're going into glute bridges. So hips up high and back down. All right, flutter kicks, guys. Nice flat back. Legs as low to the ground as you can go. All right, bringing those legs in. We're going to push through our heels. Drive our hips up nice and high. Squeeze those glutes. Keep a nice straight line from shoulder to knee. Squeeze. Good. Nice flat back when you come down. Okay. I don't want any arch in that low back, so I don't want to see any of this. No, no, no. Must come down nice and flat. Good. Well done. We're going back into our flutter kicks. Get that back sorted. Nice and flat. Let's go. Hips 
squeeze up nice and wide. And back down. Squeeze that butt at the top. Push through those heels. Well done. We only have one exercise to go, guys. The exercise we're going to perform for a minute, non-stop, but then we are done. Okay, it is the burpee. It is the chest to floor, jump at the end, burpee. Hang on, I'm just gonna set my timer, ignore this time. Nearly there. All right, guys. One minute and 30. You can do it. Last exercise and we're done. Let's go. Oh, here we go. Down and up. Come on. Chest to floor. Jump at the end. Keep it going. You do this. Nearly there. Listen to that buzzer. Yay! And you are done. Good job. All right, guys, we're going to stretch it out. Standing stretches today. Grabbing your foot, stretching that quad. Taking it to the other side. All right, so now you're going into your invisible chair. We're going to stretch the glutes. Sitting down, a little bit of pressure on your knee. You can feel that good stretch all through the glute. Good, other one. Cross that leg, sit down, a little pressure on the knee. Coming up, gonna roll my shoulders. All right, nice straight legs. And tuck that chin under, round through that upper back. And we're just gonna hang nice and low. Nice deep breaths in through the nose. Out through the mouth. Good. All right, rolling ourselves up. I'm going to take that arm across the body. A little bit of pressure on the elbow, up over the shoulder.
Good, and side. All right, rolling that shoulder up, back, and down. Grabbing those hands, hips are forward, chest is out. Lift those arms up as high as you can. Good. We'll just finish off with some neck stretches. Well done, good job, enjoy your day.